Ayana, thank you. CBS 46 is working to get results tonight for a group of senior citizens and people with disabilities being forced to live in sweltering conditions. CBS 46's Jamie Kennedy is live in southwest Atlanta where their building hasn't had air conditioning for months. Jamie. Thomas, for a lot of the senior citizens here at Baptist Towers, the crack in that window is the only way for their apartments to stay cool. A problem they say is falling on deaf ears. The city is called Hot Lanta for a reason, but for senior residents at Baptist Towers, that heat doesn't stop when they close their apartment door. I haven't had no air AC in about two months now, and they gave me a uh, like a fan, a portable, yeah, and I got a one bedroom that is still, it's 81 degrees up in my apartment right now. It's cool to come out here and then be up there. Floyd Shelton isn't the only resident trying to stay cool by sitting outside. Several senior residents told us their AC units hadn't been working for months. I called the main office four or five times and they gave me some, uh, some notice to give it to them and they should have it. and. I ain't seen nothing. We spoke to attorney Erin Willoughby about the complex's obligation and she says landlords by law need to fix air conditioning units in a timely manner if they provide it to tenants. Baptist Towers does. We reached out to the owners of the complex, National Church Residences, who told us 25 units are broken and in a statement say Baptist Towers on-site management team of eight professionals and National Church Residences Atlanta Regional Office team are working diligently and have ordered portable air conditioners for our residents. Floyd is hoping the company will keep their word so that he can finally get a good night's rest. I sweat. I keep a towel by my side. It's hot. It's hot. I'm not going to lie to you. It's, it, gets, it gets hotter during the evening. So I spoke to the company a short time ago and they told me good news, those portable air conditioners are coming today. And if we also just have a look over here, we can see a refrigeration technician only a short time before we came on air has also come into the site. Live in Atlanta, Jamie Kennedy, CBS 46 News. Jamie, thank you. Right now